Hello once again my friends, it's your buddy Nekamore here welcoming you to First Impression Fridays. What is First Impression Friday? It's a series where we're going to play games that I've never played before. Today I happen to have been sent the first, uh, a one level demo of the new Billy Time 3. So I thought it'd be really cool to check out what Billy has to offer for the Billy Time 3 demo. Uh, and without further ado my friends, it's the fifth of the week. Hmm. It's gonna be a little hard to see past me, huh? Let's fix that. Woo! There we go! Look at all that screen real estate! What are you gonna do with all that? I gotta start the game. So the full title is Billy Time 3 Losers in Time. I love it. <laughs> no friends. That's topical. Hi there, thank you for coming. I, I don't know why I said thank you for your coming. I've been watching a lot of ABGM. My name is Shelby. I'm the Princess of the Crystal Castle and Guardian of the Time Gem. I called you here today because my kingdom is under attack. A roaming knight known as known by the name of Sir Goldblade has placed the castle under siege. I, I just got out of work, so my reading comprehension skills are in the toilet. Oof! However, I was told you guys saved the game world a while back. So I'm offering a bounty for the apprehension of Sir Goldblade, as well as the return of a priceless artifact known as the Time Gem. The gem that controls time. Uh, is Goldboy in possession of the said time gem currently? Uh, of the said time gem currently? Not yet, but should he find it, the damage he would it would cause would be unspeakable. Okay, I'm gonna stop you right there. Are we talking about time travel here? Well, yes, actually. The time gem can manipulate the game world in ver many various ways. Serious misuse could cause the game world to crash, meaning our universe would simply cease to be. And you were trusted with safekeeping this gem. Why? Probably because she isn't a bigot, Kyle. I say one joke and suddenly aliens think I'm the bad guy. Racism's never funny, Kyle. <clears throat> never. I'm not a bad guy. In fact, I'd be more than happy to make you ZD. I can't eat gluten. I told you on the way here. I want ZD. Also, pizza, steak, chicken, pork, and some candy bars, and maybe a few humans, too. Mike, dinosaur man after my own heart. So what's our strategy? I suppose we could just bum rush the castle and hope that Goldman doesn't have the gem. Zerg rush as usual? It appears that way, yes. We always bum rush. It's the same strategy. Why don't you go take your frustration out on some drywall? Oh, Kyle jokes. I love it. <laughs> I want money if you're gonna make me run. Money's no good here. It will be ha Money is good here. Remember, you could use it to buy Red Bull. Thank you, Bill. Everyone else I called is either busy or under contract with Marvel. All right, it's settled. I'm gonna go, I have to clean up the spaceship. Mike uses the Sonic Drive as a toilet. Oh, that's, a, that's still dialogue. Mike uses the Sonic Drive as a toilet. By the way, anyone know what time it is? Say it. It's Billy time. <laughs> okay. It's got the, it, it, it's very consistent with its charm, I will say that. But this is a one level demo, so this is the only, only stage we got, so let's make the most of it. Crystal Crisis. Looks like it looks like Billy was the only one available. I want to test that actually. Can I go back? Yeah, like this. <clears throat> I didn't exactly give that character select screen a lot of time. Didn't didn't exactly look it over. So from the looks of it, Billy, uh, Bill has now found a way to get all the characters on one screen. It looks like. I'm very, very excited about that. Because the uh, Billy Time 2... Oh, there's some visual... There's some tearing there. It might just be the emulator settings. But, um... Yeah, uh, Billy... Super Billy Time... Or Ultra Billy Time 2 had uh, all the characters on, like, one separate screen. You had to run really far in between them. Alright, so... The double jump's still here. That's good. Power-ups still look the same. Whoop! I'm almost really bad. Uh... Oh, yeah, visual tearing. I wonder if that's something to do with the emulator. Is this? Dude, he's got Deltarune music. Uh, oh, the wall jumping's still here. Either I got <laughs> a really bad at it or it's a little funky. We'll find out. I'm, I'm floored that he has Deltarune music here. All right, a little skip there. What's down here, though? It would be remiss of us to just rush through the level. Whoop. 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 Okay. Let's just 
just another little way over. He jumps a mile high. Lord. Power up powers. Uh, back up, power up, power. That's weird. Is, are you guys seeing that on the... It's hard to tell right now. I guess we'll find out in the... Uh, ah, ooh. How could you do that to us, Bill? There's so many coins down there. What do you, th you think there's something down there? I think there's something down there. Ah, death. Death was down there, of course. Okay, well, I went for it and failed. Anyway. Oh, I don't think we're going to be able to get up that. Can we? No, I don't think so. We really broke it. Alright, I'm going to see if I can fix that uh, screen tear. Hold on a sec. Did I fix it? Hey, we are in business. That looks so much better. Okay. Oh, it's still actually so little. Okay, well, I thought we fixed it. <laughs> it's fine. It's okay. I'm, like I said repeatedly, this is a Billy Time demo. For the third game... Okay, it's you jump just a little bit too far to abuse the wall jumping. That's fine. Now this is a Billy Time game, so there's gonna there's gonna be secrets up the ass. You know it, I know it. Anyone who's played a Billy Time game knows it. <laughs> He's got a dragon statue. What? <laughs> right, this time we're not gonna we're not gonna screw ourselves up here. Ah, that dragon is so cool. Uh, I don't know if that was intentionally a, a spot where you could stand. Oh, oh, oh! No, I will never stop humming the music. Ah, shortcut. <laughs> it's not that much of a shortcut. Ah, oh, frick. Frick a fracka. Frackety frack. Uh. Whoa! Different goddamn turtles everywhere! No. Ooh! Ryan's here to help me clear. beat Billy time. There's. They're all, come on, there's something up there. Look at that. You know there's something up there in that gray area. There's, like there's got to be like a hidden block here somewhere. Oh! Aha! There was nothing up here. Oh, wait. Whoop. Is there something up here? I'm thinking no. Okay. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Sure, it's heading uh, that, uh, That's not entirely what I intended to happen. I, I, I saw that going much differently in my head. Oh, no. oh! The double sword. <laughs> the double sword. Oh no, I've got to redo that whole level. Can't get over the music. Uh, uh, uh. Can't get over the hill either without taking damage, I guess. Ha! Huh. <gasps> Alright, I only have two lives left. I better make them count. What did I just say? I just said make the lives count. So what do I do? I make them not count. Oh, there's so many turtles! Holy fuck! Aha! Ye old, ye old dicey, uh, pit jump. Aha! Right through the pillar. Oh. Must, must conserve all power ups for the boss. Oh my god, there's so many turtles. Alright, 
think we made it. All right, once more with feeling. Why you not spawn a turtle? I just want you to spawn a turtle. Hell you up, oh, missed. Please just spawn a turtle. Get up. Not what I intended, but I'll take it. Oh, come on, Mr. Turtle. Alright. Just gotta gently. I love that the turtle shell ends up dropping on like the side of the on the side of the uh, fountain, so it does like this sick move where it's like rolling across the the lip of the fountain and just smashes into Bulldozer Joe's fucking bulldozer. Jump, jump! Oh, what was that? What? He's just vomiting swords now. Do you see all these swords? Look at all those swords, dude! How can I get that many swords? I don't know what was up with that music. I said it was hard to hear. Hmm. But anyway, that was uh, that was stage one. I wanna I wanna I wanna use our our last couple of lives here and look around for some secrets. This is still very early in development, um, so there's a lot of there's gonna be a lot of changes, a lot of new stuff coming. Can't tell if that percussion line is like supposed to be there or not. At least from where I'm sitting right now. Um, so yeah, there's a whole lot more to come to this game, and this one level alone, Bill, I know you're watching this, dude. Holy shit. This one level alone, you've outdone yourself. It looks great. The design's cool. It's a lot of fun to play. I'm, dude, I'm looking forward to this game. You don't even know. Whoop. Alright, so we already, we already determined that there was nothing down there. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna try to get up. I know. I know. There's probably no perfect. Ah, it's not gonna work. Okay. Wow. Ooh. All right. Part of me thinks there's something down here. Yes, there is something down there. Oh, not death. I saved it. I don't know if there's any other like areas here that could have secrets. And these are all spots that could have secrets in the future. Who knows? Um. Part of the, like, the whole development. Whip, jump, brr. Part of me wants to, like, be able to jump up there and have there be, like, a vine that's hidden off screen that takes you to a secret area. And just have there be, like, a, a like, a, oh, god, I thought I went down the pillar, like, properly went through the pillar. But, but like, there's, like, a, a rope up there or something that takes you to, like, a tre this treasure room. And in there, there's, like, a whole level made out of gold or something. All right, we're back at the end of the stage. Whoop! I just want to. Well, actually, I don't even need the plant because I can just do that. And you know, wait a minute. How did I get up there last time? Whoop! Bah. Not like that. Bah. Nope. Okay. Whoop! There we go. Oh, we're up top. Oh, we were up top for real for a second. I just want to run. I know there's not. I know we already like. So there's nothing up here, but... Oh, wow, I went real far to the right, huh? <laughs> oh, that's fun. Well, okay, so... I think that's... How did I get a triple jump? I don't... really understand. I think that's it. Yeah. Like that! Jump, jump, jump. Is there a triple jump? Has there been a triple jump this whole time? Holy shit! Oh my god, I think there's been a triple jump this whole time. That's awesome. Whoops. Oh, well, okay. That's really awesome. Oh wait! It looks like there's something down there. So as far as I know, there's... It, obviously, it, uh, uh, we went over it to a one-level demo. I don't think there's any way to access any other content in this. Um... Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Bam. 
Yep, just a standard game over. Anyway, uh, that's all I had today. Um, first impressions? I, I said already, I'm super excited for this. This is going to be a really cool game. Loser I love the title, Losers in Time. It's so perfect. Anyway, uh, as I've said before, if you guys want to play Billy Time games, go to BillyTime.com, download his uh, latest games. He's got Billy Time Minus, he has uh, Ultra Billy Time 2, and uh, Billy Time 3, who knows when it'll come out, but um, this will eventually up there, be up there too, and it is well worth a play. Um, well, so far. But yeah, I'm, I'm absolutely blown away by what he did. It's going to be a lot of fun. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, everyone say goodbye to my cat. Mwah. Bye, kitty. Uh, yeah, stay awesome. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. And I will catch you in the next video. High five.